some conversationalist. To outside. Jump a lot. That's cool. Uh, now what do I do? Private residence. Well, it's a JRPG, so I'm just gonna go into people's houses without their permission. Hello. Huh. Lately, many ill omen things have been happening in Anatolia. All right, thanks. Great conversation. See ya. Fuck out. Oh, I didn't mean to go in there, but no, I'm doing it. So whatever. <laughs> If Vilnor army comes this way, the whole town would be wiped out. All we can do now is pray. Oh, wow. This is... Pretty... No, I didn't mean to fucking what? No. No. Okay. What's over here? The tavern. The other day I opened up a treasure chest and some poison gas shot out at me. I fucking skipped past the thing. Luckily I was crouching down, so it didn't do anything except give me a big scare. Oh, I see. Crouch down to not get hurt by traps? Okay. Got it. Alright, so I guess I need to go Main Street. Really. What is this? Oh, that's where I came from. Okay, well, no. I guess I don't do Main Street. Just go further right then. What am I supposed to be doing right now? I wonder what lilac means in the language of flowers. Ah, who cares about flowers anyway? This is the only place I haven't checked yet, but I doubt this is where I need to be either. So what the fuck am I supposed to be doing? How kind of you to visit an old man. Why don't you stay for tea and I'll tell you all about my grandkids. Or not. See ya. Main Street, Manlon Garden. Oh, I assumed that was not where I was supposed to be going because that's where the cutscene was yesterday. Yeah, it doesn't look like this is right either. Good day. So if you jump into that, it also triggers it. Got it. Okay. What am I supposed to be doing? Oh, it's wrong. Main Street. Private residence. Let's see if I miss something on Main Street. This is Arngrim's house. Uh, let me ask my brother. Maybe he could be my appointment keeper to tell me what the fuck I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, never mind. I went out and hung out, and then she came back. That makes sense, actually. Huh. I need to speak with you. Uh. It's not her. Oh, is it not? It's an agent. Oh. Is this about a job? Is that the same agent from earlier? The delivery that needs to be made? Delivery Is this about a job? Yeah. yeah. Did you take it? Leave tomorrow morning. You'll be alone again for a few days. And what about the princess? Whatever. Hmm. My part is gonna be you then, huh? Uh. <laughs> Ugh. Argrim is so mean. <laughs> Name's Badrack. Nice to meet you, Arngrim. I heard all about you. <laughs> if you must engage in such meaningless blather, do it on the road. The cargo must be delivered. Jeez. Vilnor was about a week's journey away along the Great Road. Ah, we're going to Vilnor. Mm, those are the guys who have the, the army. The journey was uneventful, and by the third day we were halfway there. The journey was uneventful, okay. I'm getting plenty of money for this job, so who really cares what's in the thing? Huh, Mr. Bodyguard? Uh. <laughs> that Lambert. So here's what's not going to happen, but what I want to happen. Uh-huh. Um, is, is that what I'm actually interested 
You mean it wasn't the agent who hired us? Hey, bodyguard, something's coming up behind you. Uh oh, combat time! What? Knights! And lots of them! Knights! Ugh! CQC! Desk looked to have been kicked up by a group of Altorian cavalry. Wait, why are Altorians like they were what? chasing something? But I never imagined it was us. What the fuck? Oh no! Are you smuggling the princess out of the country? Dude, I think we're getting straight set up. I never should have agreed to take that package without knowing what was inside. Yeah. It just wasn't like me. You goof, bro. You mean these are the ones? Let's get out of here. What the fuck? Dude, the princess is in the box. Call it. Our parcel? Our parcel? It was that little tomboy princess. Tomboy princess. I don't know if I'd call her a tomboy, but okay. Is tomboy code for feisty because proper women aren't aggressive? I guess, or yeah. Looks like we'll have to wait till night and run. Oh shit, we're on the we're on the lamb now. Damn that Lambert, he totally screwed us. Damn him. You filthy. You knew? I didn't know it was in the damn thing. My client was Lambert, like always, and... The soldiers know that Lambert... Huh? No way, can't be. The guy's a Vilnor spy, you know. What? Nobody was supposed to know what that was in the thing, man. Oops. Uh, well, something about Vilnor and been princesses. I'm quite happy to kill a stinking knave, but I've got more important things to do. Damn. Jesus. Hard mode. What the fuck? Oh Jesus! Oh, it was the other thing that I wanted to call while we were um before I got distracted by combat and What? I want you to brother. Like, what, 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 That'd be pretty cool. Oh shit, a monster. That's pretty ferocious looking monster. <laughs> Help us! Uh, what's going on? The princess was unconscious. The captain told her to give us this medicine that he got from Lambert. Isn't that the princess? Holy shit. Two hands. Oh no. He knew the abduction would be discovered, so he sent wow. some medicine. Oh my god. god. What new ball? I mean he's if pretty fucking evil, yeah. To Vilnor, no problem. But if we were discovered, the cavalry would use the medicine. Oh god. Did they give him human transformation medicine? This guy's some next level fucking play gameplay. It was as we see, which is to say now it's just a giant fucking monster. And afterwards, all were dead. All were dead. Perhaps even the princess. Oh god. Dude, this is heavy. Not your typical uh, fantasy fair of the era. That's exactly what happens when somebody drinks ghoul powder. Ghoul powder? How do you drink a powder? That's really what I'm concerned about at this point. <laughs> it turns a person into a howling demon. Necromancers use the stuff all the time. I'm a totally trustworthy human being. <laughs> Lumbar is a necromancer? <laughs> Listen, I'm not, a, I'm not a thief, I'm a rogue, is all I'm saying. Angela. <laughs> Angela? You mean Jolanda? What are you talking about? It's time we got back to Artolia. I'm getting out of here. See ya. Maybe he made the right choice. 
Oh man. I wasn't going to run. Badass monologues. And him being too thugged to run away from a monster. I never felt like this. Lombert! Lombert! Going to kill you. Oh shit. But what will become of Jolanda? Uh, he at least is a good guy. He gives a shit about what's gonna happen with the princess. Alright, let's do it. I'm not controlling this run cycle, unfortunately. Oh. Oh, okay. Stop! That- what the fuck? <laughs> Human life is not something to be thrown away. If you're a true warrior, you will find your path in the maelstrom of battle. Oh, that's a good line! Yeah, this is good prep for my next Fret Lark character. The Battle Maiden? Valkyrie? Creatures of darkness. Alright, this is getting to be fucking really sweet very quickly. Alright, so we get to have a three man fight. Come to me, Dark Warriors. Battle awaits us. Yeah, battle awaits us. Okay, so now I can use all three of these. Wow, Freya's super strong. She has like 6,000 HP. Cool. I wonder, like, can you modify these moves? Like, if I hold a direction, do they do different yeah. moves? No, it doesn't look like it. Freya just fucking teleports around and shoots energy beams at people. It's pretty sweet. Nice. So you do slightly more damage the higher you get the hits meter up. And Freya just takes no damage. She's fucking... That's a tutorial badass. Over attack. What the fuck is over attack? It means that you attack too much. No, there's no such thing as attacking too much. No, I think I think it meant overkill. Like battle is my greatest pleasure. Okay. But this was different. You think it's foolish, brother? Because you're content with what you have. The flashbacks are real. You're wrong. Marr. You're wrong. That was, I'm convinced. I was told. His brother's wrong. I'm it was through others' yeah. misfortune that I felt myself to be strong. Damn. That's right. I, who was myself without morals, who was I to judge others? He's pretty self aware. Who was I to look down on them? Injustice. Injustice. That's fucking... I began to realize that the king and I were very much the same. I'm pretty impressed with the dialogue, especially, you know, considering it's translated. It's very well localized, right? Very well done. I don't really have an opinion yet about the gameplay, because I haven't been able to see more than fucking three minutes of it, but... Just take her soul, I guess. Poor princess. Huh, I thought you might show up sooner or later. You really should have just run away. It will avail you nothing to calm the disturbance here, young man. Maybe not, but I'll sure as hell avail me to smash your face in. Huh, I see. You may be a genius on the battlefield, but when it comes to the higher arts, you know little. Oh shit, he took his glasses off. <laughs> you realize you are already dead. Uh, what? <laughs> Magic, let me show you. <laughs> I just like that he straight up pulled the, you are already dead. I beg of you, you must save Arngrim, please. Wait, why does she fucking care so much? I, mean, I guess he did. Save. He might be saved. Go beat up Lombard. Uh, I, I. By being allowed to continue.